Hi, welcome to online tutorial videos from JC Wireless. This is our project demonstration video and in this video we are going to demonstrate the working of a project which is uh, ANN based electricity price forecasting. So this kind of work uh, uh, is used and has very uh, high application in real world because if we know the pr uh, what is going to be the uh, the price one day ahead then we can plan accordingly okay so further for uh, we also provide online training help in technical assignments we also do freelance project based on data science python machine learning embedded system matlab etc so if you have any such requirement you can contact us through our website which is www.jcbrolabs.org or you can also mail us at info at the rate jcbrolabs.org so let's start the demonstration of this project so we have already created this project so if you need the files or any assistance uh, within this project you can contact us at our mail through our mail id okay so in this project we have implemented this ieee conference paper day ahead price forecasting of deregulated market using artificial neural network so in this paper authors have used the ann uh, in order to forecast the price one day ahead and uh, as you know uh, in order to uh, forecast the price through ann we need some data and feature vector as well uh, which needs to provide so what they have done they have taken the previous one week data uh, as a feature vector and then they keeps going on up to the next one and based on that they applied it to the neural network created a target vector trained neural network and then applied the same uh, in real time or uh, for the simulation purpose. So this is their structure kind of and these are the uh, their results. So we have obtained the similar results. So they have uh, forecasted for seven days and we also have done the same. So now let's open the MATLAB to demonstrate it. So first of all uh, in uh, in this project we have a lot of data files because in uh, uh, in ANN or ML based uh, application data is the critical thing okay so if uh, we need a huge amount of data in order to train the network so uh, we have taken the one year of the data the concept was taken from that paper but the data was different so we have taken one year of data of MCP price and the volume and then this is the entire amount of the data okay and then this uh, data has been in, uh, partitioned or has been uh, has been transferred into a form of training data set and the target data set so here is our training data set which we created okay uh, there are 48 uh, sets right and because if you go through the data these are the hours so one hour first hour second hour third hour 24 so if we are taking two days of prior data so there will be total 24 24 48 rows so that is why there are 48 rows here and then uh, this is created of our entire data set now the correspondingly uh, we have created a target data set okay so target data set means that 24 hours for the next days next day right so that is what uh, we have done here so now if we will okay so we have created the MATLAB files to do all these things right so here uh, this is the file which uh, mm, do uh, this data segregation that means it uh, create uh, the training data and the target data once this training data and target data have been created now we uh, now we used the uh, ann app of this uh, provided by the matlab from here as a ann uh, curve fitting because it it seems like a net fitting problem okay so we use this net fitting uh, tool from here and then train the net and then transferred uh, the trained nn and then uh, transfer the trained ann in the form of a function and then we have used this function to get the data right uh, to uh, get the estimated amount of data 
now there is another file which is here uh, okay uh, this data predict so we have used the train ann directly here and uh, then uh, we have estimated the data so if i run this file for you you will get all the kind of figures there okay so these are the files uh, or the results which we were getting so these are the actual msp and the predicted msp so if you look at it carefully this and uh, the trend in which we have created that is uh, uh, very accurately predicting the original one okay so obviously this is the prediction so there will be some prediction here but the prediction is not that bad uh, when uh, so it is something like uh, like predicting the stock market for an accident so you know how much volatile the market is and how much difficult task it, it is okay similarly we also have created different files like this one so this will create the entire put the entire figure on a same window like this so we have created this one and similarly we have also created the another file right <coughs> okay this is okay so i hope you have found you may have find this uh, project uh, content or whatever we have discussed very interesting and useful for your research work uh, if you want any kind of assistance uh, in your research work or if you want uh, to these project files then you can contact us through our mail id uh, which is www dot which is jcbrolabs at gmail dot com or you can also uh, visit our website uh, which is www.jcbrolabs.org so that's it for this video thank you yes and one more thing please uh, let us know your comments or reviews uh, by commenting uh, below this video okay so that's it for this video thank you